try to do is how do we capture somebody's attention and make those eyeballs valuable? And one of the things we're doing in our area is we figured out that most people don't really care about a specific service need unless they need it right then, but they do care about the neighborhoods they live in mm -hmm. and their kids go to school. So what we've done is we create these little ch television networks or channels called the best of. So the best of White Plains, right? I'm going right up your alley here, Aaron. The best of White Plains. Aaron becomes the uh, the, the the exclusive X in his market, and then he takes it out and does what Greg's doing, which is interviews people, creates shows, do, does different things. And what happens all the while is when people start to see the best of my neighborhood, they like that page, and now you have their attention. So if you're consistently doing video shows, and you're selling advertisements in between those video shows to local restaurants, local golf courses, local entertainment places, people are gonna come. And when I'm standing there and people are edifying me as the best of best of white plains in marketing, then what happens subconsciously to, to my brand? I become the best of, I'm on the page, it must be me. So we're mm -hmm. capturing eyeballs, placing them regularly in a spot where people care to look like the best of their own home neighborhood, and then we're basically exploiting that. You can do your advertising. We did we did one in Tri City, Tennessee's Tri, Tri Cities, Tennessee. Only one, there's only one Tennessee, guys. In case you didn't know that, <laughs> Tri City, Tennessee. And we, within, well, there is, there is a middle valley. There is like a middle Tennessee state. So I assumed there is. We have some state called Middle Tennessee. I don't know. Are you wait? Are you watching the the NCAA tournament on the side there? Is that where you keep turning your head to? <laughs> Because that's what I'm doing. That's what's no, going I, on. I, I wish I had a passion for college basketball. I wish. No. Oh, so, but, but what happened, what, just to finish that thought, because it was a place that people lived and it was a pretty burgeoning city and, and all this stuff, within three months, we had 5,500 people that liked that page. That's a lot of eyeballs. Oh. Mm -hmm. yeah, so, that's it's incredible. a good, so find a niche, exploit the niche with, with your video. You got to make it entertaining. It's got to be entertaining and informative, right? But other than that, be there all the time. Four times a week is beautiful.